Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I have another island tour for you guys and I am just so excited to get on with this tour because it is a forest core island. This island's creator is pinewood.acnh on Instagram and I am actually doing a forest core island right now. Honestly, haven't even done one build yet. This is gonna be some important inspiration for me. Let's go ahead and get started. Let's check out this map. They have this map, but they also have this beautifully stunning drawn map. It was made by crossing.lele on Instagram. Just look at this waterscaping. I mean, it goes all throughout the whole island and I'm really excited to see how they were able to waterscape all of those areas. And these are the villagers. Recently, I just like been noticing Grizzly more and I feel like I'm kind of interested in seeing how he is. So if I see him walking around, I'll be, I'll be very excited. Make our way to the entrance. I love these two cliffs. Love the weeds. Here's a little suitcase welcoming you into the island. Feels very enclosed and cozy. So let's go ahead and pick up these gifts. A leaf. Oh, that goes actually really well with my outfit. A log pack. Yes, we were thinking alike. I knew I could not go to a forest without my log pack and a leaf umbrella oh my perfect i actually love this thank you so much here we go let's go ahead and explore this island Ooh, ooh! i love those two logs right there just dropped oh beautiful beautiful diagonal bridge really like that i love the weeds on top of the cliffs and this cozy little house. Um, this is Eric's house. I really do enjoy um, small villager houses. They just feel so cozy. And I, ooh, this river, wow. I really like the shape of the river. Hello, Fauna. Oh, and then we got another house. I bet this is Fauna's house. Um, oh, I love this little setup with the watering can and the plants. Super nice. And there's a river going through their houses. Little enclosed pathway. Oh, this is beautiful. Love this little picnic area on the beach. There's like two blanket designs. I love that. Beautiful codes, They're like mismatched. Great job on that. And this laundry area tucked away in the trees. Amazing. A lot of socks on the ground. Very cute area. Picnic area where you can relax. Oh, this house is so hidden. It's very cool. And here is another villager's house. Beautiful. Beautiful bridge. You do an amazing job with waterscaping. It is just really nice to see and this amazing waterfall. And here is a wishing well. And I am also very like interested in keeping my beaches a little bit more simple because I find it looks really beautiful. Wow, this is such a cute little section. This is a cafe design and I really like this. It's very, warm toned, a lot of brick. You got like two counters right here. Really awesome. And I love how you can just walk right into it. Here's the dock. 
very adorable little picnic spot and this villager's house is on the beach this is Blair so she's got a nice little beach house so nice I love these rivers and then we've got another's house this might be Grizzly's house I, I'm gonna check I'm not at a Grizzly's house. This is Bo's house. Okay. Really nice. He's got a wood chopping area. Beautiful. His house is also very nice. Cute little mushrooms dropped. And yes, I really love their use of these logs everywhere. It just adds it just fills up the space. I love these stone stools and just adding just one little simple item on top. We are heading to the campsite. It is very enclosed in the, in the forest. And we've got little cooking going on and then a picnic. And the campsite right next to a river. Oh my goodness, and we have this ladder right here. Let's go ahead and climb up. Can we climb with, okay, yes we can. We can climb with the leaf. And oh boy, oh my goodness, look at who it is. It's Grizzly, oh my gosh. What are you doing up here? I was not expecting you to be here. Oh my gosh, he is absolutely adorable. Grizzly? Oh my gosh. Wow. So nice to meet you. Honestly, I haven't seen him much. Grizzly, how are you doing? Okay, so here is the, the mum field. At the top of the campsite, I love just walking along these trees with these flowers. And ooh. I see a amazing farm down there. Stunning waterfalls, absolutely amazing work with these beautiful rivers. Come on, let's go. Let's tour together. I absolutely love this farm setup. Using the potted plants as crops is really really nice and I just love the mixture of things being um, planted I love the, the pumpkins mushrooms love this absolutely gorgeous and we've got an incline going up to the house so let's go ahead and get in there Really nice setup. I see you've got some laundry going on. Wow. This is so magical in here. It is super whimsical and I love the dirt floors. And there's just a lot of brown in here. It's very cozy. And you got a little writing section. So cool. It's like a little witch cottage. And let's go ahead and go to this left room. Such a cute kitchen. And yes, I just love how cluttered it is in here. And these little bottles right here look like little potions, little spices. Very, very fun and whimsical kitchen and then we'll make our way upstairs wow this is a bedroom look at those amazing windows that is so beautiful that look out into the magical forest love the leaf piles and a little sitting area that little garland and then the bed very cute house and here is a hidden pathway I just love that. And it goes to Red's Beach. 
and we can climb down and here it is a little suitcase and a barrel you got a little bit of artifacts right here if you've got a library I love these little sections that they do like the perfect amount of items placed. Look at that. That is absolutely stunning. I love that. It's a library, you got seating areas and a writing station. Beautiful, beautiful library. And then we'll go up these stairs at a post office, very cluttered with a bunch of boxes and papers, presents as the packages. I really like the jail bars, the brown telephone booth. It's the best variation. We've got a cozy little picnic. Love this phone. This is such a nice item. It's very beautiful. Nice little picnic. Diagonal bridge. I love all these diagonal bridges. Love the evergreen ashes. Trees being used in between the regular trees. That is a great tip. They just look really nice peeking through. I like that. And we've got a little planting area or garden shop. Hidden setups in the forest. I really admire that. And we've got Able Sisters right here. Love this fencing. And I like these little shopping bags and shoes on the barrel. The sewing machine. Boxes of shoes, hiking shoes actually. And then we've got a beach. Ooh, I like this little fishing area. This is a great idea for a small um, spot on your beach. Ooh, got a boat. I really like this. Very cluttered workshop fishing area and this deck on the rock this code this stunning bridge right here and i see nook's cranny peeking through and very overgrown and simple with the trees very nice. It's a little bit hidden, which is good. And simple farm. And oh my gosh, so cute, these villagers. And I really like this fencing used. Love this. Oh wow, the bistro table going up to this really, really adorable museum. Like, I love this fossil that she used and this scattered artifacts. I just really like that. But, oh, <laughs> the mouth is moving. <laughs> but anyways, I really like this really simple museum with artifacts. It's very beautiful. Thank you guys so much for watching this tour. This island is just incredible. They just did an amazing job. It's really inspiring and I honestly believe that you guys should visit for yourself, especially if you're gonna be doing a forest. Make sure to follow the creator of this island, which is pinewood.acnh. I will have all of their information in the description and I will also have the dream address. If you guys aren't subscribed, then go ahead and hit that button. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me and I'll see you guys on the next one. Goodbye.